A very warm welcome to the Gallagher Stadium, the home of Maidstone United Football Club. This is the Kent Football Association Merit Under-14 Girls Cup Final. Grey Wanderers against Footscray Lionesses. Two sets of players making their way out onto the pitch. Let's have a quick look at today's two lineups. First of all, Cray Wondrous in the white shirts and the black shorts. Their management team, Danny Stanton and James Pitt. In opposition, it's Cray Lionesses. They're in the yellow and black stripes. Their management team is Mike Hannaway, Richard Compton and Jody Pearton. Today's referee, Katie Allen, assisted by Ruth Jackson and Connie Goff. Dottie Blagden is the fourth official. Lining up ahead of kick-off, the Cray Wanderers players and the match officials and, of course, Foots Cray Lionesses. Boys, put ball into the penalty area. Comfortable save in the end by Ella Vick. Next time. Wrestling match over on that far side. She's got the better of her opponent, but the ball ends. Comfortably saved by Ella Vick. Compton. Really good play from Compton. It falls nicely. And Freya Jackson scores the opening goal. It's her tenth of the season, and she gives Foots Cray Lionesses the lead. The bounce was favourable, but she took it really well. By the goalkeeper, and it can uh, clear away. As he panted, he gets across in, and it's head up. There again. Onto that left foot, and the shot just wide. Decent effort from Nola Baxter. They've come back from falling behind Cray Wanderers, and they've certainly reacted well. Looking for an equaliser, Chloe Boyce. Lovely footwork, she's beaten everyone, still Chloe boys! Oh, that would have been a smashing goal had it gone in. Really unlucky. Throw in by Miller. Okay, Dick. Chance maybe here for boys, And it's gone in! Chloe boys with the equalising goal. And she had her hands on her head, she thought the chance had gone. But it did go in. And Cray Wanderers are level. Anthony. Brian turns. Lovely play. Once again from Boys. And then the shots just wide from Rain Bryant. Well down the outside of turn and gets the cross in towards Eden Fumi Nassat's cleared away. Shot from distance. Comfortable save. Wondrous coming forward. Frankie Davis. Once again, it's boys. Gets the shot in. Strikes the crossbar. And she couldn't quite follow up with the rebound, Lola Baxter, and it's cleared away. Anthony cut out well by Garner. Brian inside, and a quick ball from Boys, and this is Nwakini, who scores! It's 2-1 to Cray Wanderers, and it's Chidima Nwakini 
who fires it out of the reach of Ella Vick and into the far corner. It's a really good finish. And for the first time in this cup final, Grey Wanderers have the advantage. Finish things off. The header from Faye Miller lands on the roof of the net. Yeah, and it's uh, Chloe Boyce gets it forward. Boyce once more. This time it's over the crossbar. Turning back. To keep hold of it there, Spellman, but it's back with. Ryan again through the middle. It's Chloe Boyce. It's saved really well by Ella Vick. That could have put this final to bed once and for all. Time ticking by. And indeed, there goes the final whistle. And it's victory for Cray Wanderers in a very entertaining cup final. Foot Cray Lioness is ahead through Freya Jackson at half time. But Chloe Boyce and Chidima Rakidi with the goals as Cray Wanderers come back to win 2 1. Chloe Garner had an exceptionally good game at the back for Foots Cray Lionesses. It was a very closely contested final. Foots Cray Lionesses had a buy in round one, 4 0 win against Old Wilsonians. They beat Hugh Veterans 5 1 in the quarter finals. Six without reply in the semi finals against Danson Sports. And they led today at half time in the final. But it wasn't to be in the end. But a fabulous performance all the way through from Foots Crate Lionesses. Yes, to collect their winners' medals are Craig Wondrous. Started in round one with a 14-1 win over Sittingbourne and a 7-1 win against Kings Hall. Had a big win in the quarterfinals, 12 0 against Tunbridge Wells, and then they took their goal tally to 37 in 4 in this competition with a 4 0 semi final win against Ramsgate. They really have been in and amongst the goals, and a little bit more difficult today against great opposition in Foots Cray Lionesses. But Cray Wanderers got there in the end. Back of the queue is their captain, Ellie Harkin, and she's got her hands on the trophy along with Maddie Waits. It's congratulations to Cray Wanderers, the winners of the Kent Football Association Merit Under-14 Girls' Cup for the 2023-2024 season. <laughs>